much makeup cake on talking when the game's on. There are a few things that I live by. One of them is if a question starts off with, is it cheating if I? 83% of the time, the answer to that question is yes. 83? 83%. Who did that study? Barney Stinson, How I Met Your Mother. <laughs> so here is that question. And this was not posed by me, but posed by somebody else. Is it cheating if you're texting with another potential opportunity while you're in a relationship? No question. It's yes, definitely cheating. Yes. It counts as cheating. Yeah, I think it's at least emotional cheating. Yes. Emotional cheating. Yeah, emotional I don't, I don't cheating. think I like or agree with that phrase, emotional <laughs> cheating. No, I think it is. Because if you are, are you happy in the relationship? Are you, are you going to break up with the person? Because if you are texting somebody outside of your relationship, that is, that's inherently a flawed relationship. That's true. I don't necessarily think that it's cheating, though. I think it's, I think you cheat when you cheat. I don't I, think it's cheating if you're I texting and because you don't cheating. know what's going to happen. Maybe you're in a rough patch and you kind of just, I'm not saying it's right. I'm not saying it's good. I don't think it's as bad as cheating. I don't, I don't think I it's think, cheating until you're actually cheating. I think it depends on what that text says. If it's like, hey, Obviously, how are you? it's not like, if it's what's like, the weather in Cincinnati? So if you're sexting while you're in a relationship, that's cheating. Define sexting. If you're saying illicit things in on the phone while you're in a relationship, I think that that's cheating. I think that there's intention behind that. I think that if the person was in front of you, you would do things. Oh, okay. You think that would... Okay. I think uh, it's... Cheating is like... These days is like a boxing match. And I feel that texting someone while you're in a relationship... And you're having not, it doesn't have to be sexting, but it's like, it's kind of like a jab. It's like, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of, kind of cheating, but I'm, I'm just texting, you know, that's it. When it becomes a full on blow or it becomes a knockout punch and you're at a hotel room in the North End and you're getting down, then it's, it's like full on cheating, but it's still a form of cheating. It's virtual cheating. It's not good. It's not right. And you're, you're. You're cheating. I agree with two out of three. It's not good. It's not right. But I don't think you're cheating until you're actually cheating. I think maybe there's a situation where somebody is kind of, you know what? He's not or she is not feeling that great in a relationship. He's kind of just like, he's just distracting himself or herself. He's throwing some things out there. But if faced with the actual scenario, he wouldn't do anything. He would realize that what he's if, happy what with his. Uh, let me ask you a question, Phil. Yes. You're living with a girl. No, you're not, but I'm saying hypothetically, yes, I know, you're no, living I know. with a girl. Right. And you find out that she's been texting some guy. That's correct. Who's been say, he's been saying, you're so beautiful, you're this, not like James Blunt, because we yeah. all know that's the worst song ew, ever. Ew. Oh, ew. Awful. Right? No, yeah, ew. But it, it's, it's one of those things where you, you find out. You're, you're too good for him, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Oh, you know, whatever. Oh, you're so sweet. What, how do you take that? Oh, it's I'm not happy about it, but do I? Would I then, if I broke up with her, would I? Would I then say, "Oh, my girlfriend cheated on me"? No, no. you'd say she was texting. I'd be like, bitch. she was. You know what? She was involved. Yeah, she was texting, and you know, I thought there was something going on, or potentially something going on. Right. I just felt like. But you know what? I think if I got out of that relationship, it would. There, I'm sure there would be other things that would be like, you know what? This is the thing that put me over the edge. I think it depends if there's intention behind the text. Right. right. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm I not saying it's that. not inappropriate. I agree. Yeah. But I think what to if, say what something is said... cheating, to me, that is a very serious accusation. And I, I think that, you know, if you, if you catch somebody, and we're going to get to this in a second, but if you catch somebody doing something like that, it's bad and probably be bad enough to break up with somebody. Sure. But I wouldn't say... Absolutely go as bad as saying somebody cheated if they were texting and did, never necessarily did anything. They, they, they have that, um, the line where they may actually go yeah. to that, you know, the I next think, thing. I think that's the, th like, the line before you cheat. Like, yeah. you're thinking about cheating. Right, yeah. You know, you're, you're, you're on, on that, that threshold. Yeah. yeah. So how about if you're sort of getting towards the end of a relationship and you kind of know it's going to end. You're not into it. You're, you know, and you start... Well, that's your escape hatch. And you yeah. start and is. you start in contact with somebody else, and then you end your relationship, and then soon after you start up with the other person, but you hadn't done anything, nor even maybe even seen that person, you know, in any kind of 
wrong way. How do you guys feel about that? That's tricky. Okay. That's tricky. Sh 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 sh. <laughs> it's tricky. <laughs> yeah.